So I went into hospital and I knew something was wrong. But when I saw the first midwife, there was no fetal heart, there was no, no movement of my baby. So then I knew my baby was not alive. That was the hardest labour and birth of my babies. Because the hospital hadn't completed the paperwork, my baby was buried in a pauper's grove. Two policemen knocked on my door to tell me that if I didn't um, have the paperwork completed, my baby would be buried as a pauper. They had to come and tell me that. I think that sent me into a spin, but because of the, the support that I had from family and friends, I was able to get through that. My baby was buried in, in the Melbourne Cemetery, in the pauper's grave, and I'm happy about that because I couldn't change that. Because the hospital hadn't completed the paperwork, 